DJI has just released their new SDR transmission system, which serves as a lighter weight and more affordable alternative to consumer grade Wi-Fi based video transmission systems. But it's not just size and price. Thanks to exciting features such as its versatile working distance, minimal latency, and its ability to transmit to an unlimited number of receivers, as well as up to two mobile devices at a time, this is a powerful, flexible, and cost-effective transmission system that's got you covered where it matters most. For this video, we're working with the DJI SDR Transmission Combo Kit, which comes with one transmitter and one receiver, a camera mounting adapter plate, and a USB A to C cable. As the name would imply, these guys are SDR or software defined radio powered, meaning your radio transmissions are powered by software as opposed to hardware. This doesn't just mean a higher quality image, it also means you're getting a stronger connection, stronger penetration between walls and other physical barriers, and a clear image across longer distances as opposed to systems of similar size and price. In the case of these guys, they offer triple bandwidth with 2.4 GHz and 5.8 GHz bands, and an additional DFS band with the seamless audio frequency hopping technology found in other DJI transmitters. They enable up to 1080p 60fps live feeds with a max bitrate of up to 20 megabits per second. When it comes to image transmission, the SDR transmission system allows you to transmit to an unlimited number of receivers while in broadcast mode. We didn't get to test this out given we only have one receiver to work with, but this is a great feature for allowing different crew members to independently monitor video from the same source on set. The transmitter can send a signal up to 10,000 feet, which is about 1.9 miles, allowing you to comfortably monitor video from safe distances. The system has a reported 35 milliseconds of latency, which is less than a frame of delay at 24 FPS, which should be suitable for scenes with lots of movement. The SDR transmission system supports both HDMI and SDI output, and when working with tablets or mobile phones, you can connect over Wi-Fi or via USB-C. The system is also compatible with DJI's control mode for gimbal control. In terms of physical design, these guys are very lightweight and portable. The antennae fold down neatly so they don't obstruct anything during storage and transport, and they're color-coded so you can instantly tell which is the transmitter and which is the receiver. Setting them up is quick and fast, and the two units have touchscreen functionality for easy setting selection. Finally, they can be powered by a Sony L-Series battery, or the transmitter can be powered directly from your DJI gimbal. And that about wraps it up for this very quick look into DJI's SDR transmission combo. Between the flexible transmission options, the impressive range, and the ability to connect to a limitless number of monitors, it would make an awesome tool to have in your camera kit. They're fast, extremely portable, and offer great performance all in a more affordable package, making them great for small to medium sized film crews, and of course, making sure you look good for your YouTube videos. But as always, I wanna know what you have to say, so be sure to let me know your thoughts on DJI's new SDR transmission combo in the comments down below. For now, I'm Sam with B&H, and I'll see you next time.